What is going on guys? Jameson Amaros and as always, Charlie Sardelli. And we are two realtors with Fathom Realty here in Colorado, coming at you one more time with a uh, community spotlight. This time we're highlighting Littleton, Colorado. Mm -hmm. And specifically, we want to take you guys through downtown Littleton, a historic downtown Littleton. Very historic. I mean, this place is, this place has something for everybody when we talk about a community that you'll never be bored in. Yeah. Littleton, Colorado is one of those areas. Absolutely. And I mean, downtown Littleton, as we walk past two historic landmark sites uh, on the street here, there is a slew of things to do out oh, here. Yeah. I mean, they have a chocolate factory. They have the chocolate uh, therapist, the chocolate therapist. Yes. They have a place called Playforge, which actually has a, a D and D table yep. room specific that you can rent out yep. in order to play with your friends. They've got a uh, neighborhood meat market, Lavaca, that we just went into. And I mean, they've got picanha, they've got ribeyes, roast, tri-tips, everything. And it's this mom and pop shop that's high quality meats. You've got the tavern. If you want to go out for a late night drink, you've got one of my favorite restaurants of all time, the Melting Pot, yeah. Fondue. If you guys know know about it, you know what's up. So one of the cool things, and Charlie, I'm sure you've got this vibe, but it's all mom and pop. Yes. So like extremely local mm -hmm. shops. I mean, you've got some of the big ones, right? Like Smoke and Fins is a national chain. Yeah. But then you've also got, we're coming up on Born to Bake, which is a creative bakery. Mm -hmm. It's family owned. Yes. Uh, we, we just got asked, done talking to the, the lady who owns the photography yep, right studio. Right behind us, actually. Kelly Weaver. Kelly Weaver. Yeah. And it's just so cool that to feel the community, especially in a place that is growing at the rate that this it place is, is growing. Right? Yes. It's like you get a small town feel, mm -hmm. but there's a population of 46,000 people that live in Littleton. Yeah. Right. So even with that, I mean, the chocolate therapist, come on. I mean, yeah. one, you can do coffee, chocolate and wine pairings, mm -hmm. right? Seven days a week. It's open. So on Sunday, Monday, you had a bad day at work. You could hop in here. Um, there's, I think I've seen four or five different barber shops that are all barber shops. Owned. There's three coffee shops. Yeah. Um, the Devil's Cut, I'll go ahead and throw some stuff in here for them, but it was just so welcoming and everybody's oh, yeah. in there, you know, like standard coffee shop, small town feel. But again, it's not really what you would consider a Colorado small town. No, and we've right? talked to, I mean, we've talked to owners at three or four different places so far mm -hmm. that are just perfectly okay and, and excited to talk to us about their business and what they offer. Yeah. I mean, it's just, it's incredible. For a big city, it mm -hmm. is a very, very cool downtown area yeah. that has a ton to do, family, single, Young adult, I mean, you can find anything. And you can even, you're only, what, 15 minutes down from downtown Denver? Well, not only that, you get the light rail station. Yeah. The mineral light rail station, which mm -hmm. we can highlight. You hop on there, light rail up to the Broncos game. You're right on the outskirts of uh, Highlands Ranch, which means you're about 20 minutes from Chatfield. So yeah. during the summer, you want to cool off, rent a paddle boat, whatever you want to do on Chatfield That's Reservoir. Awesome. Yeah, That is awesome. Sweet. Well, I'll tell you guys what, my arm's getting really tired from holding this camera. And it's got those guns, baby. Right. <laughs> We're gonna head over to Breckenridge Brewing. Breckenridge Brewing, yeah. Breckenridge Brewing, because yep. we want to showcase it. It's one of the coolest places here in Colorado. And yep. if you don't live in Colorado, you've probably still heard of them. Oh yeah, absolutely. Because one of the largest craft breweries, I would say, in the nation yep. right now. Mm -hmm. But we'll catch you guys and see you guys over there. All right, guys. See ya. Hey everybody, welcome back with us. We made it. We're, we're at we're at Breckenridge Brewery. We are at Breckenridge Brewery. We got some we got some awesome awesome beers, awesome libations. What's that one? This one is the Dank Drop Hazy IPA because you know huh, I'm hella dank, bro. You, you can tell by your shirt is <laughs> yes. very dank and bright. Everybody, look at me. I'm bright and shiny. Bright and shiny. A little bit of peacock happening. <laughs> That's here. right. I love it. What'd you get? Uh, the pineapple and orange juice drop. That sounds IPA delectable uh, on this. 88 95 degree day that right? we have here <laughs> i know man it is it is warm it's toasty yes. but outside with a very nice beer mm -hmm. with some cloud coverage and that's one of my favorite things about colorado if you're thinking about moving here i come from north carolina <sighs> and you're surrounded by trees there in colorado because of how flat it is before you get to the mountains the view of the sky is just beautiful and it's it's something that not a lot of people think about yeah you don't see it unless you unless you're here yeah so. and i mean just to be able to actually see the layers of clouds in the mm -hmm. sky is yep. is incredible yeah backdrop of the rockies mm -hmm. it's it's sweet you yeah. feel it you yep. just feel yep. it when you're here and i mean just having this outdoor seating area there's some people behind us that are we have a uh like a, a wedding party behind uh, us yep. we have some people painting at, at some of the tables out here i mean it's it's just a vibe. You it know, is that's, a vibe. That's all you can say. It's a vibe. Yeah. If you're looking at moving to Littleton, like this is one of the places that is a huge draw because it's right in your backyard. Mm -hmm. um, I mean, we talked about it earlier, right? 45,000 people live here. Yep. 
but you have something like this smack dab in the middle right off of Santa Fe mm -hmm. that you can come to whenever. And on like Fridays and Saturdays and Sundays, you got the cornhole set up, yep. live concert series, mm -hmm. um, all sorts of stuff. Too. And it's, if you guys don't know Santa Fe, it's one of the right off of 85, which is a main road that kind of cuts through the side streets yeah, of, basically of the you, front range. Yeah, you can go from here to downtown in about 15, 20 minutes, mm -hmm. or you have to light real like we talked about earlier. But yeah. yeah. But I mean, it's it's just, it, it just showcases again, like the fear, the feel, the atmosphere of yep. this place just shows off like, hey, we want you to enjoy the nature. As you've mm -hmm. heard us talk about so many times in the videos, like it's so evident here. It is. Yep. That it, it be outside, enjoy it, especially because a lot of people think that Colorado is just snow the entire mm -hmm. time, right? But again, High Plains Desert, people. <laughs> we don't get a lot of snow when we do, it melts very quickly. Mm -hmm. Yep. Yeah, and it's, uh, I think this is something that makes Littleton so unique, right? Because we took you downtown into historic downtown Littleton yeah. that has all the mom and pop shops and it's walkable, restaurants, mm -hmm. everything you think of that you want to do, you can do there. Small town feel. You've got, you know, as far as households go, 60% of the homes are owned, mm -hmm. right? So only 40% are rented out. Um, average home price, 670000 as of as of last month and dropping a little bit. Yeah. And you get also something like this. Mm -hmm. If you go another... Two and a half minutes down uh, Santa Fe, you run into the Alamo uh, mm -hmm. uh, Theater and yep. uh, Poorhouse. Awesome, awesome place with they, a whole outdoor reclining seats yep, and an outdoor mall. Mm -hmm. um, and uh, I mean, you got a bunch of different shops there, yeah. and then you got some of the big chains like Chick Fil A, all that kind Absolutely. of stuff. Absolutely. And then just to the north of us, mm -hmm. uh, we have Hudson Gardens. Yes, which I think you went to. Yeah, yeah. Right? So I actually went to Hudson Gardens in October uh, with my girlfriend and my cousin and his girlfriend because they actually had like a jack o' lantern display yep. where they had over i think it was 150,000 pumpkins yes. that have been carved into artistic uh like shapes even yeah. like there was a dragon there was a train the hogwarts train oh yeah was on yep. there mm -hmm. it's it was really cool yeah so you got really aspen cool. groves mall here mm -hmm. with alamo draft house which is a movie theater so you catch a movie grab a beer yep. go shopping during mm -hmm. the day stop here for a pint of pineapple or the dank ipa uh, they've also got some fantastic food here. We're yes. just not hungry today, mm -hmm. but they have some great food. Oh, yeah. The cool thing about, about Colorado and a town like Littleton is not only what you can do, but the growth potential. Mm -hmm. Like you, you hear us talking about 45,000 and top 10, top 15 schools, yep. top 10 for new, but there's still so much area to expand and grow mm -hmm. here yep. that if you, even if you come now, you're not missing out on no. the growth. Nope. Not at all. Yeah. yeah. It's, it's awesome. Man. I, I just I, I could sit here all day and drink just chill and drink pineapple orange mm -hmm. juice drop IPAs. I yeah, mean, yeah. There's it's, nothing there's nothing better on a hot no, summer day. No, not at all. Not at all. <laughs> but I'll tell you guys what. Thank you so much for joining us on another community spotlight out here in Colorado. You know we love doing this for you guys. Yep. And as always, guys, let us know, like, comment, subscribe to the channel. Living in Colorado, the Mile High Perspective. You can get in touch with us at resotr at themilehighperspective.com or give us a ring. Phone number 303-578-0263. And again, guys, we're just two Colorado realtors. We're with Fathom Realty here, and we just want to showcase mm -hmm. how badass our state, state is. is. If yep. you want to move here or move within Colorado, man, we'd love to hear where you want to send us next. Yeah, because, so. I mean, hey, I'll go anywhere you want me to go as long yep. as there's something neat and something you, to drink. You can find something somewhere. Right? Absolutely. Well. Signing off with you guys. Thanks for joining us again. Demo. Hey, cheers, my man. Absolutely. Like and subscribe, guys. We appreciate it. Thank Thanks. you.